Okay, so I've seen this um, problem a number of times. This type of cylinder right here, I've seen it where people have called me and they said, help, help, my key is stuck in the door, what do I do? How do I get my key out? And basically I'm going to show you what's happening and why, why, it work, why it works that way. So you have your cylinder here. You put your key in, you turn it, no problems at all. You go to get your key out and you find your keys jammed in there. No matter how hard you pull, you can't get your key out. So the trick to it is, is to actually rotate it back to the 12 o'clock position. If you're looking at it now, you can see the keys off at like the 2 o'clock position. We want to rotate that key back to the 12 o'clock position. Okay, now you can say that the key is in the 12 o'clock position. From there, you would want to push this little circle in here. Have your key in the 12 o'clock position, push that little circle in and pull your key out. If you don't have it in the right position and you're pushing down, it's still not going to come out. It needs to be 12 o'clock position. Hold that little circle, the center circle, which is this one right here. Hold that back and pull your key out. Now, the reason this is happening is because these little screws on the back of your lock have actually worn themselves loose. So I'm going to loosen it just to simulate what will actually happen. Now, I've loosened those screws, as you can see there. I'm going to put my key into the lock goes in nicely, it turns nicely, I go to pull it out, it's jammed. And you can see what's happening there, as I pull it out, that center barrel is actually coming out with it. Once I push that back with one finger and pull it out, that's why we do it. As a locksmith, it's kind of second, second nature, we put the finger on the side there to hold that, and then we just slide it out. Bring it back to 12 o'clock, give it a wiggle, slide straight out. From there, you'll need to remove your cylinder, Tighten up these screws. Now be careful, you do not want to break these screws off, otherwise you'll be up for a new cylinder, but they must be tight. Some people put a little bit of Loctite on them. Be careful not to stab yourself with a screwdriver, very common. You go down as tight as you can and all of a sudden slip and whoops and you stab yourself with a nice P2 Phillips blade. It's happened many a times to many a locksmiths. And there you have it. There's your keys. They now go into the lock, they turn and they come out with no assistance but if that does happen just recapping that little center circle there you need to push that down pull it thanks for watching